This is a quick little um, simple makeup tutorial that I did. These are Kayla Lashes by the, I don't know where it says. It's like some beauty supply, but it's like the, the luxury brand, the V Lux by Envy. And these are Kayla. I don't know if you can read this. Can you read this? There are the Kayla ones. My hair, um, this is actually like my go-to hair. Like this is um, Brazilian by the way from Eunice hair um, on AliExpress. And the inches, I think my longest inch is probably like 18. I believe 18, possibly 20, but I believe it's 18. Um, and I have a closure. So I was like, let me go ahead and film this real quick. Cause I'm like in the mood to go ahead and film a makeup story. Cause I have not did one in a while. I have so many vlogs, but like no makeup. So I was like, let me go ahead and just do this really quickly. Um, this was a struggle because for one, I tried to do wing eyeliner and it did not come out right the way I wanted it to because I struggled with that. And I had to use whatever I had here because my original makeup or like the makeup bag that you know the makeup that you normally would use i didn't even have it so i was just like wow the day i want to do one i don't even have it so i just used whatever other makeup i had so for my foundation which i will show you i had to mix the um kat von d lock it um lock it foundation in the color deep 74 warm which is actually my summertime shade and i had to mix it with the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Warm Honey. So this is actually too light for me. So I just mixed both of these and boom, there you go. But um, yeah, these curls are, I don't know if I just said it, but these curls are um, two days old. So they're just some regular little curls and then I just did the little flip with the flat iron in the front. I didn't show that, but yeah, it's more so the makeup. If you would like to see how I achieve this simple look, keep watching. So I've done my eyebrows already off camera. Um, I'm gonna go into my Morphe palette and use that light tan brown color as my transition shade. I normally always use this as my go-to when I'm like between colors. I don't know why, I just do. <laughs> so I'm going in with this ashy browny color um, in the Morphe palette as well and um, putting that into my crease. And I would keep just building that color and blending it. Um, I honestly didn't even know what I wanted to do with this look. I just knew I wanted to go ahead and film something because I haven't filmed like a makeup look in a little minute. It's just been a couple vlogs. So, yeah, I just was like, let me just do something simple yet yeah, cute. But I'm going to go into this pinky um, shimmery color in the Morphe palette. This is actually the shimmer palette. The first one was the matte palette. So this is the shimmery one. Um, I didn't want to put it all over my lid because some people go, in my opinion, overboard with putting like the whole eye. And I have small eyes, so I don't want like a big old cut crease on my eye, like with a bright, shiny color. Like, no, that's not really my type of eye. <laughs> but um, I started going under my eye with this orangey color. I was like, nah, I don't like it. Not at all. So I ended up going back into the Morphe Shimmery Palette and using that um, under my uh, waterline or lower lash line or whatever you call it. I'm not a professional, so half the time I don't know what I'm even talking about. <laughs> Y'all, Cardi B is my girl. Like I've been on Cardi B before she was on Love and Hip Hop. Like I love her. But anyway, so um, I actually had to mix my foundation. Like this is actually the Kat Von D Lock It Tattoo Foundation. And that's actually my summertime shade. So it's, it was actually too dark right now because I haven't been in the sun. So I had to mix it with um, the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Warm Honey. I mixed both of them on the back of my hand and, you know, try to get this shade that I have now because my actual foundation that I use every day, well not even every day, but my actual foundation is somewhere else, like my whole makeup bag. So I was just using whatever I had here at home to um, film because I was so thirsty. Just go ahead and do this makeup tutorial because all I have is like vlogs up lately. So I just wanted to go ahead and do this. So yeah. My lashes are actually from the beauty supply store. Um, they are in the style Kayla. They're actually in the gold pack, the Lux pack or whatnot. But yeah, those are those. 
So that's the foundation that I had um, mixed together and I'm just like blending the rest of my face out. So I'm gonna go into the True Complexion palette and use that contour shade to lightly contour my face. Um, and I don't highlight my face today, <laughs> just not today. Um, I used the CoverGirl setting powder to set the rest of my face. Like I said, my makeup bag was somewhere else. This is actually what I was using before I was on the Sasha Buttercup powder and the Lore um, Mercer powder. And even when I was using this, I actually didn't get any flashback from it. It just, you have to lightly put some, don't just cake it on your face. Like that's how I think you become ashy on the face. Like who wants to be ashy in the face? <laughs> For my lips, I'm actually going to use a Beauty Supply Store Crayon Lipstick in um, the color Nude. And for the lip gloss, I use the Marc Jacobs Lip Gloss. I don't even know what color that is. And then a brown lip liner by NYX. Thanks for watching and like and subscribe to my channel.